President Bola Tinubu has signed the Data Protection Bill into law. The Nigeria Data Protection Act of 2023 provides a legal framework for the protection of personal information and the practice of data protection in Nigeria. National Commissioner Nigeria Data Protection Bureau, Dr. Vincent Olatunji, said these are the NDPD Strategic Roadmap and Action Plan Validation Workshop in Abuja. The bill was sent to the Senate and House of Representatives for consideration and passage on Tuesday, April 4th, 2023, via a letter from former President Muhammadu Buhari. The commission will be led by a national commissioner with the responsibility of regulating the processing of personal information. Speaking early on PLOS TV's News Now, Okbayemi Tomori, President, Private Telecommunications and Communications Senior Staff Association of Nigeria, hails the move by President Tinubu. Uh, we know that uh, for a long time before now in Nigeria, uh, data protection has been something of uh, very great importance and has uh, been practiced in so many uh, uh, strata companies, uh, in both Nigerian companies and uh, uh, other global companies as well who uh, reside in Nigeria. Right now, what it means is that uh, even though some people take it uh, for granted and uh, information leakages happens once uh, and uh, I mean sometimes, uh, but now based on the, what the president has signed into law, uh, people will be held responsible for when this happens, then you can actually uh, take people up uh, under the uh, legal laws of the country and hold them accountable when such happens. So as it is right now, uh, much more attention will be paid to data protection in Nigeria because there is a commission to oversee what, uh, what is happening, how people do it, how information is accessed, personal information is accessed, how it is being stored, and uh, how it is being uh, processed. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.